Good morning and welcome to another video. Ahorita ya llegué to the employee parking lot. It is currently 6.28 in the morning. Beginning a four day trip today and I am doing a turn. I was, trying, <laughs> I was actually just looking up the airport code because I've never heard of this place. It's in Mexico. It's technically in Xtapa, but it's Zihuatanejo. Zihuatanejo? I don't even know how to pronounce it. I've never seen it before. But that is where we are flying today. It is San Francisco to Ixtapa and then to Los Angeles, layover in Los Angeles today. It's a long day because the flight time is about four hours. So it's a turn, we're doing a turn. So <sighs> I got some coffee, so hopefully this will hold me over. I did pack my own lunch as well since we will not have time to get off the plane and get food. But yeah, I am pretty excited. I've never flown this route, so I'm curious to see what the crowd is like. If it's locals, or gente mexicana, um, like our Guadalajara trips, or our Guadalajara flights are usually just local people from Guadalajara or from Mexico in general versus our other destinations like Los Cabos, Cancun, and Puerto Vallarta. Those are mainly tourists that are on those flights. So I'm curious to see what this crowd is like. I think I'm the only one in the crew that speaks Spanish. So, si si es gente mexicana, they have me. <laughs> because I will be able to translate and be able to communicate. But yeah, ahorita les voy. Um, I'm just gonna gather my stuff. My purse, my, all my cards just fell out of my wallet right now when I was trying to put in my purse. So let me get myself situated and I will see you guys on the plane. All right, just went through security. Um, I was at the bathroom brushing my teeth. <laughs> and I encontré un... Una compañera, and I was just like, hi. Alright you guys, I am in Los Angeles. I actually just got back from a date. <laughs> supposed to hang out with one of my friends tomorrow she's also a flight attendant and so that is the plan for tomorrow the flights today weren't that bad we had actually a group of people traveling for a club to Ixtapa. It was a group of 80 people, so that was pretty interesting. The crowd was super random. Like, it was a, bu a bunch of random people going to Ixtapa, so I couldn't tell you or say, like, oh, it's a local crowd, or oh, it's a party crowd. But, it was a pretty good flight, pretty easy. The group of 80 were really, really friendly and nice. And everybody was just chatting and everybody was in a good mood because they were all traveling together. Put on the serum before I put on my cream. But coming back, it was... <laughs> I'm telling you, it was just a weird crowd. But I'm just gonna brush my teeth and call it a night and I'll catch you guys up tomorrow because I'm, I feel like I'm just a little delusional at this point.
guys yeah my arregle this is day two of my four day trip i had breakfast with one of my friends this morning and we went to manhattan beach it was absolutely beautiful the weather was perfect we just kind of like laid out on the beach for a little bit and caught up and yeah me arregle i am flying to up to seattle so los angeles up to seattle and then seattle to denver we lay over in denver tonight i think we land around midnight so pretty late but the layover is 15 or 16 hours so we don't leave until late afternoon the next day so i have plenty of time to sleep in and explore once i wake up tomorrow but yeah all right the way of a hat i think the van is coming to pick me up in a few minutes so i just quickly need to put my bags together and i'll go downstairs let's go Denver, it is almost one in the morning. <laughs> yeah, I'm still muriendo de sueño, but I'm gonna show you guys quickly a little room tour. So we have bathroom and good lighting in here. Closet. My maleta. And then here is the room. Nice big bed, television, my mini doll, and a little sofa and coffee table on this side. Let's see what view we have. A bunch of like corporate buildings. But it's cute. Buenos dias. Ya arreglada. I am just wearing some sports attire because I realized I didn't really pack anything too crazy. And honestly, I was planning on going to the gym here in Denver. But a ver cómo me va con el tiempo. It is currently almost 11 in the morning. Well, the plan is to walk over to the, the train central station where another flight attendant had told me that it's really really cute it um has a lot of like cool monuments and lots of eateries and places for shopping so that's where i'm gonna walk to and just kind of explore a little bit you guys i just looked up because I wanted to see the distance from the hotel to the train station. But they have a Meow Wolf here in Denver. And it's literally a mile and a half from the hotel. So I was kind of low-key tempted to go. But I don't know. I'm like torn. So Meow Wolf is kind of like an art experience exhibit. And the first one I had seen is in Santa Fe, um, New Mexico. And they just opened one in Vegas and I think they might have another location, but they have one here in Denver. And basically it's like these trippy looking rooms with hidden doors, hidden basements. It looks super cool and super fun. I'm kind of tempted to go, but it's $50 to go in. And I think it would just be much more fun if I was with someone so we could like take pictures and just be like, oh my God, let's go in here, let's go in here. I don't know if I should just go and I could vlog and it could be a fun thing by myself or if I should wait until I have this layover again. But the thing is like, this is my first time laying over. So I don't know how often these layovers are. Um, 
But so I would know for next time to invite the crew and let them know like, hey, do you guys want to go to Meow Wolf? It is $50, so they would have to really want to go. <laughs> That's the plan for today. I'm just going to walk around, explore a little bit, hopefully come back and hopefully have time to go to the gym. They're picking us up at 3 30 so i have a little bit of time but yeah let's worry about conmigo and let's see what downtown denver is about <laughs> for today's flight so I bought this cock cock <laughs> this coconut almond chocolate yogurt definitely recommend if you are a flight attendant to go to your Whole Foods and get the I think this is called the chef's plate meal so basically you choose a protein and two sides and it's roughly about 12 to 14 dollars depending on the choice of protein that you get so I got the paleo chicken and my two sides, I got Brussels sprouts, which were roasted with, I think, pepper seeds. And then I got a pasta salad, and that was $12. So this will be my meal later today. I also bought, bought some nectarines. I do have dry um, arena oatmeal. So I'm thinking about slicing and dicing these and adding them to my oatmeal. That's going to be another meal for me later today. And then I bought these two jerky sticks. These are sausage, butcher snack sausage link. These are 24 grams of protein. So this is like basically drinking a protein shake or having a protein bar. I also like adding these if you buy the canned soups. A lot of like canned uh, split pea soups or canned stuff that I can heat up on the plane and adding these just gives it a little bit more protein because a lot of those soups don't really have much protein in them. But that's pretty much all I bought. I don't have time to go to the gym. <laughs> Porque se me hizo tarde, pero ahorita me voy a bañar y I'm gonna change and then we're gonna head out. You guys, we are on a 37.9 Max. This is one of our newer planes. It looks so clean and it smells so nice. You guys it is day four of this four day trip it is go home day i just looked and the first leg is actually a deadhead so that'll be nice i am deadheading from sacramento up to portland which means i will be flying as a passenger which is perfect because i just purchased um some lunch and i will have time on the plane to just sit down and eat it <laughs> And then Portland back to base, back to San Francisco. 
My friend is actually in San Francisco right now. She is another flight attendant and she currently transferred up to be Seattle based. So she has a layover in San Francisco. Y me mandó mensaje y me dijo que wants me to spend the night with her. I haven't seen her in a while, so she wants to see me and catch up. So that'll be the plan once I get into San Francisco. I'm not gonna go home. I'm gonna go to her hotel and meet her and catch up. She recently was in Portugal, and so I'm sure she wants to tell me all about her trip. She went there with her choir. She's a little pajarito, cantarito. <laughs> but yeah, that is the end of this four-day trip. Thank you guys so much for watching and following me along on this four-day trip. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to don't forget to leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in the next one.